The development of new legislation on environmental protection connected with restricted use of dangerous substances resulted in gradual refuse of lead-bearing soldiers. There are two main reasons for going to lead-free technologies. The first one is that lead is destructive to health. The main lead consumer is automobile industry. In electronic industry, specific weight of lead is relatively small from 0.5 to 7 percent, according to different sources. But in consequence of quick growth of electronic system waste, especially household ones, a problem of getting rid of lead is becoming more burning. Choosing an alternative for lead soldiering, we should take into account damage done with materials. For example, cadmium is a high toxic and shouldn't be used. Ford Motors Company, for example, prohibits using cadmium bearing materials. Stibium is also high toxic and cannot be considered as a base metal in alloys. Silver and copper are used in light free soldiers in small quantities. Their danger level is low. Tin and zinc are main elements that can be used for food covering, but they become toxic in increased doses of in food. Bismuth is harmless metal that can be used even in medicine. The second reason is high thermal loads on components resulted in requirement strengthening concerning working capacity of junctions. In automobile industry, more microcircuits are placed in motor department with temperature of 150 degrees centigrade and higher for reducing the number of wires. Strength properties of lead and tin bearing soldiers under cycle thermal loads worsen at the temperatures of 125 degrees centigrade and higher temperature causes plastic deformation, diffusion, recrystallizing and grain growth in junction. Standard tin lead silver soldiers with melting temperature of 179 degrees centigrade and tin lead with melting temperature of 188 and 83 degrees centigrade are characterized with rather good properties in microcircuit stability and consequently reliability of soldered joints at a working temperature of up to 150 degrees centigrade. But mechanical stability of soldered joints worsens when the working temperature closes to a melting point and under heat cycling in conditions of elevated temperatures, therefore probability of tin lead alloys damage is rather high. One of the best alternative soldiers is tin silver copper. This soldier is included in a jade list and recommended by European Britain Consortium as a main soldier for electronic industry after examination of potential materials. Analysis of tin silver copper systems show that this soldier is the most resistant to splits under thermal loads and that is the best alternative to a tin lead system.